In this video, we are going to learn how you can create CRT effect in Photoshop. Hello everyone, my name is Abhishek aka Design Survey and you are in the Design Survey YouTube channel. Without further ado, let's get started. Hello guys, so we are in the Photoshop. We have these two images. You have to download them. I will link them in the description. I simply go to edit and click on define pattern and now name it whatever you want and just click on ok do it for both these images now let's create a new document i will take 1080 by 1350 and simply click on create now simply create a solid color adjustment layer make sure it's black now just drag and drop your image i'm using this png of a gun now go to image adjustment and click on hue and saturation and decrease the saturation all the way down because I want this black and white. Now go to filter, pixelate and click on mosaic. Put around 10 and hit OK. Now go to image adjustment and click on levels. We are going to use levels later in this video. So simply click OK. Now click on this FX icon and click on pattern overlay and simply add your pattern. Make sure your blend mode to hard light, opacity to 99 and you have to select the pattern we just created and you can choose whatever you want i will go with this one it will give a little soft look and angle to zero scale to 10 it's the same as mosaic and make sure your link with layer is unchecked and click on snap to origin and simply click on ok so now as you can see we have this black in this image and i want to remove this black part so how you can do that simply right click and open blending options and make sure you click on blend interior effects as a group and just increase this current layer to 50 or something 57 is fine and this is how it looks like now Let's put this in a group. Press Ctrl G to put this in a group. And now right click on your group and open blending options and add four drop shadow. This is for adding color in this whole effect. And you can find all the settings in the description. But let me go through one. So simply you have to choose brand new mode linear dodge add and let's change the angle whatever you want. It's totally up to you distance to 1 and spread to 2 and size 5 and noise is 5 and I am just increasing little bit you know the size and everything just a little bit and increasing some noise that's it so you can experiment or you can copy my settings whatever you like now in the blending options just decrease the fill opacity and add inner glow okay so here it is add inner glow and make sure you copy my settings the most important thing is source make sure is center and you can just copy my setting i also put this in the description so you can check it out and simply click ok and there you go now you can click on levels and you can play with the slider to get the result you want whatever you want like you know can just play with the slider to get the best result that you desire and this is how it looks like so i really work hard to create these kind of videos so make sure you like this video and share it with your friends subscribe for more amazing videos like this one and i'll see you in the next one